Hey everybody, this is my Ascend H12 hybrid kayak canoe, and last year I put a Minn Kota 30 C2 on here, just a basic no frills uh, Minn Kota 30 pound thrust outboard, and I took the head off of it and mentioned that I would shoot a video about removing the head, and I never did. So all I want to do is make one important point about when you remove the head from your Minn Kota, and I'm sure most other um, trolling motors will function the same way. As far as taking the head off, that's not going to be anything too complicated. I believe there were a couple screws that came up from underneath or possibly from down the top. No, probably from underneath. Uh, you unscrew them, the top would come off. You'll see a whole bunch of wires and, and brass connections and pins and stuff. You can simply disconnect all that without screwdrivers or anything. Just unplug all the wires and everything. You'll then have to unscrew this, which holds the bottom piece on. And then when you slide that off, what you'll be left with would be four wires coming out of the top and that's what confused me was the fact that I had four wires uh, I wanted to wire this directly because I've got my own speed controller wired up here in the front of the boat and I just want this hard wire directly into my speed controller so I wanted to do away with all of the um, you know one through five and all of the speed coils and all that stuff and I wanted to bypass all that stuff and wire it directly so I was a little bit surprised when I saw four wires sticking out it turns out that all you have to worry about is what you would expect you'd have to worry about which would be your black wire and your red wire the other two I cannot remember remember the colors of them but whatever the other two colors are stuff them back down in the tube or whatever you want to do with them but ignore them they are the wires that go through all the speed coils and everything if you want to hardwire this directly by removing the head just do exactly what you think you would do and wire your black to your black and your red to your red and forget about those other two colors. So that was the only thing that confused me. I called Minn Kota and I asked them about it and that is exactly what they told me. They said those other two colors are the wires that are involved in all of the speed controls. So if you want to remove the speed controls and just hardwire it directly, ignore those other colors and just wire the red to the red and the black to the black and you're good to go. So there you go. Easy, quick tip about removing the head of your Minn Kota trolling motor. So thanks for watching. I'll see you on the next one.